guys welcome back to my channel so in today's tutorial I'm just going to be explaining how you can import photos into your app so I'll just call this import photos demo oh. and it's actually really simple so you would have noticed that uh, whenever you create a new Xcode project it always has a assets project uh, folder so what you can do with this is you can just drag and drop whatever pictures you want so if I just bring this to the side I have a picture of an apple here and if I just drag this and put it into here you can see there is a 1x, 2x and 3x so the 1x is for the OG like iPhone 3 and iPhone 4 and then the 2x is for retina displays like um, so iPhone 8, iPhone 7, iPhone 6 then 3X is like the super retina display so 8 plus, 7 plus, 6 plus and then all the iPhone X's so I'm only just going to be using 1X because this is quite a small photo but this was just to show you how you can import photos into your app and now to use that photo all I have to do is bring an image view in uh, center this in the screen if I can do that over here, uh, we'll just add whatever constraints it wants me to add, and then I can just use this image, but using that uh, name it had, or it'll just appear here. So if I click that, and there we go, there's our apple. And I can make this a bit bigger. So if I want to increase this size, I can just increase that, and oh, uh, we'll just reset to con suggested. Uh, I don't really mind. I just want this apple to be centered. Uh, once again, reset to. And now we have our uh, apple. And this is just whatever we wanted. I don't really. Uh, we'll just not worry about this constraint issue for now. But yeah. So that was how you import photos into your app. And yeah so I guess this also works for textures and pretty much anything I don't know if it works for GIFs but we'll have to see about that so this is just my Apple and yeah this was a short video but it was just to explain how you can import photos into your app so thanks for watching and I'll see you in a future tutorial bye